what I'd love to touch on is your transition from from finance to transformation because obviously yeah. they're quite different. Could you talk me through your thought process? I, I guess kind of on the face of it, they do seem quite different, but actually there's a lot of synergies, I think, between the work I was doing within Intern and Audit and Risk and Programme Assurance and then the transformation work that I'm doing now and have been doing for the last number of years. And I'd say both sets of roles are largely project-based, um, and focused on kind of driving positive change um, forwards. They both are very collaborative style roles. You're working with different functions within business and different teams and, and collaborating cross-functionally to get the best out of everyone and ultimately the, the best objectives for the business. And so I think there's a number of synergies in, in those roles um, and they really draw on a, a number of things that I personally love the most in terms of that collaboration, um, teamwork, cross-functional um, work, and really no two days are the same, but both in the intern and audit work that I was doing and now also in the transformation um, roles that I've had. So yeah, I think a number of synergies and, and really the, the transition for me happened quite organically. Um, I think at, at certain times in my career, I probably felt a bit of pressure to answer questions of, you know, where do you see yourself in three years or where do you see yourself in five years? And you, know, you need to be planning ahead. You need to think about what's the role that you want in, in two roles time so that the next role can be one that gets you there. And whilst I think that is excellent advice, I think personally I've often felt a bit inadequate because I've not necessarily been able to answer those questions. I've, I've not necessarily known I want to get from A to B um, and this is exactly how I'm going to do it. I've probably always held myself to a couple of <coughs> questions, those being am I happy in the work that I'm doing and am I growing and developing? And I think when I've answered no to either of those questions is when I've found it's the right time to make a change.